Hi, everybody, along with Ray Ferraro. My name is James Sabolski. Welcome to Toronto. They don't get a chance to connect too often. Does this make for a, an intriguing matchup for you tonight? Yeah, it doesn't necessarily mean the game's going to be any better, but you get to play against different guys. The fans get to see different guys. It adds a little bit of air of, I don't know, expectation to the game. Two teams looking start for a win, and we are set to go. The Leafs start with possession as we are now underway. Nice dish from the left wing. The Leafs have the puck in the corner. Passes on over to Goudreau. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. Throws it on goal. Too much congestion blocks the shot. The Leafs have it now. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Oh, what a hit! Those are the ones you feel in the morning. Here's a shot. Turns it aside with a glove. Markstrom's going to hang on to that one for a whistle. Quickly on top of that, James. He needed a cover there. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. We're still scoreless. Lindholm's won it off the faceoff. Moves it to Goudreau. Ahead of steam now towards the front. Here's a chance on the doorstep. Oh, denies him with the paddle save. Excellent chance. They worked the puck into position, and it, he scores. Well, I don't think anybody's really settled into the game yet, and already we have the game's first goal. That's about as lucky as you can get. You need some puck luck most of the time to win. There's a good chunk of it. Guys, we know he's a powerful player, and we saw it with his big rig superstar ability there. He shielded the puck with his body as he drove it to the net, and it was the perfect play as he scores a beauty of a goal. Great poke check on the reach. Slides it back to the blue line. No room for that one to get through. Settles things down and gets control of it once again. And he handles a cross ice pass. Quick pass to Coleman. Cross ice pass. And that one's broken up. The Leafs move to the offensive zone. Coleman's got the puck along the wing. Toronto's gained possession. And now it's over to Kerfoot. The Flames take possession in the defensive end. Nice zone entry from the middle. And now it's grabbed by Hall. Takes the feed. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Calgary's got the puck along the boards. From the left side, they gain the zone. The Leafs look to start the transition game. Couldn't make that one happen. To the front! Whoa! He scores! It's good to be greedy. You get one, you chase that next one really put your foot down on the opponent. So nice, they snipe twice. The goalie's probably got to stop this, but I don't think he's set, James. That turnover didn't give him much time to get set in the net. Inching closer to the midway mark of this period. Calgary's got a two-goal lead. They'd love to build on it. Puck picked up by Hall. Dumps it in. The Flames have it behind the net. Here's a short pass to Tube. Puts it in deep. Backlund's exploring options with the puck. The Leafs gain possession. Toronto's got it in their own zone. Gaining momentum along the wing. There's the whistle from the linesman calling an offside. Kachuk's got that it's tricky zone ability, which is when he uses unconventional moves to create chances. 
Matthews dekes his way past the opposition and finishes with a quick shot to light the lamp. His shock and awe zone ability is really impressive to watch unfold. I'll be keeping tabs on these players all night long. Scores! Anything you can do, I can do better. Wow, that didn't take very long, did it? They give up the one goal and they go right back down the ice and score. That's really impressive work. That's a great goal, but really it's all in the past. So deceptive, so creative, great vision to be able to see this play and then deliver the puck. He's known for being a great playmaker, and we saw it there. That pass is his third eye zone ability, and he skates away with a well-earned assist. The Leafs win the faceoff. Moves it quickly over to Matthews. And he slides it quickly to Ponte. Broken up in the neutral zone by Matthews. The Flames scoop it up along the boards. And just a good old-fashioned solid body check on the play. Manages to hang on. Toronto's looking to break out. Picked up along the wall by Sandine. Here's a chance in front. Made the stop on the play. There's the whistle as the puck stopper elects to hang on. Oh, they're not going to be very happy with themselves. They miss this 2-on-1. You just don't get very many of them. But the goalie makes the save, and that chance goes away. Past the midway mark in this period. The Leafs still trail by a goal here, but they are back into this one, only down by one. Great reflex on display tonight on his part. Uh, he's going to feel he missed one there. You don't get many chances that clean. The goalie turns it aside. The Leafs take it from the side. Couldn't complete the pass. The Flames gain control of the puck. Slides it across to Lewis. Into the attacking end. Here's a shot. Turned aside with a glove by Campbell. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Campbell's blocker comes into good use there. Good positioning, and he's able to deflect it away. Both teams are set. They're ready to drop the puck. Monahan's won the face off deep inside the offensive zone. Oh, I thought he was going to be beaten, and he somehow got a piece of that. Good reach to the stick to knock the puck away. Manjapati's picking up steam. Here he is, shot right in front. That's blocked. The Leafs will play the puck from behind the net. Quick feed to Kerfoot. Sends a pass over. Makes a move and the puck hops away from him. Scrum along the boards. Here in the corner, he grabs the puck. The Leafs take over on possession. That opportunity is rejected. Receives the pass. Here's an opportunity. What a save by Campbell. Here's a shot. Oh, and it's another save on the play. Campbell's done nice work here on this scoring chance to turn it aside. Getting into the later stages of this period, it's 2-1. Calgary's won the faceoff. And he blocks a shot. Great defensive play. Moves it to Matthews. The Leafs played along the boards. First period nearly in the books here. Quick pass to Kachuk. Across the line. Slammed hard against the wall. That's a 50-yard dash and a 25-yard gym. Long reach breaks up the momentum. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Matthews. What a stop as he puts out the fire! It's official. Period number one is in the books. Now's your chance to play clean. Drop your plastic cups, bottles, and clean paper products in the recycling bins throughout the arena. Thank you, fans, for joining us in the campaign to save energy and keep our city clean.
Still lots of hockey still to come, so get ready here on EA Sports. James Sobalski, Ray Ferraro bringing you all the action. Period number two is about to go. Well, after an intriguing opening period, here we go. It's period number two. Puck is dropped, and we are underway. Ray, what's your assessment of the game to this point? The Leafs are going to have to find a possession game that looks a lot different than that first period. They chased it around, and as a result, they're chasing the game. The goalie reads this man advantage break perfectly and is in position to make the save. We're still in the early stages of this period. The Flames lead it 2-1 in what has been an entertaining game thus far. Calgary's got it in the offensive zone. Denies that opportunity. I think through traffic like that, you're just hoping the thing hits you. Stopped by the goaltender. Markstrom's able to make the save and on top of that, deflects it out to the corner. Slides the puck over. Stops him with a glove. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up. Spreads out and makes the save. These are positional saves. This is a good scoring chance, and he makes the stop with his stick. And we're moments away from getting back underway here with the puck drop. Toronto's got it in the defensive zone. They go on the attack from the left side. Puts it up front. Off a stick, and they can't connect. Picked up along the boards by Hannafin. The Flames move the puck in the defensive zone. Through center along the wing. Goudreau's going to play it against the half wall. Nice bank pass off the boards. Handles the puck. Things starting to get a little physical out there. Here they come on the attack. On the doorstep. And that one's broken up. Campbell's opted to hang on to the puck for a face-off. Matthews can't avoid the body contact. You want to look for a place to escape. Sometimes there's nowhere to go. Gets a hold of the puck. Denied by the goaltender. The Leafs have it against the wall. Here they come up along the wing. Nylander's got the puck. Kind of lost control for a second there, but regains possession. Turns it away on the slap shot. Scooped up along the wall by Tanev. Manjapani's carrying it ahead. The 360 with the puck. Denied by the goaltender. Campbell's on top of that for the whistle. Pretty quickly on top of it to kill the play. Goalies work on this all the time. We get a look in the highlight how they angle the puck off the blocker away from the net. More than half the period left to play. The Flames are clinging to a 2-1 lead. Backlund's won the draw here in the offensive zone. That goes off a twig. Moves it on over to Engvall. Gains the zone on the left wing. Takes a shot. Oh, they do it again. Grabbed along the board by Kent. Wow. Scores right on the doorstep. He pounces on the rebound and puts it home. The rebound snapped away. What a nice shot. But the goalie's got to do a better job cleaning up that rebound. You can't leave it right there. Centers are set. Face off ready to resume play. Backlund's won the draw here in the neutral zone. Takes the feed. Too many bodies in the way. The Leafs have it now. Here's a short pass to Engvall. Takes a wrist shot. Oh, wow, stops him again. No, sir. 
after the first stop, he's in good position to make a second. Markstrom's ability to read the play is evident. He gets the blocker on this scoring chance. Marner's been noticeable already here tonight, guys. He's used that zone ability, and it's made him effective and even helped the team score. Nice start winning the draw here inside the offensive zone. And the traffic jam in front blocks the shot. Take it along the wall by Dubé. Calgary's ready to go on the attack. Moves it quickly over to Brody. Takes the pass. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. Here's a shot. Oh, serves up waffles for dinner with that stop. Passes over to Hannafin. Coleman's moving the puck through his own zone. Quick feed to Matthews. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. Great stretch passes and connects. Moves it to Coleman. And that carries off a stick. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. Nice pass. Quick pass to Tavares. And the intensity starting to ramp up here after that hit. Slides it over to Coleman. And he slides it quickly to Mangiapane. Skates to the crease. Toronto's got possession of the puck. Quick feed to Tanev. Can't find his man. Stopped by the goaltender. Dumps it in. Calgary's got a hold of it against the wall. Picking up steam in the offensive zone. Puck grabbed by Muzzin. Gaining momentum up along the side. Wrist shot Whoa. from the slot. He scores! And the deadlock's been broken. Now you get a chance to control the pace of the game. It's tough to do it in a tie game. Now you've got the lead. Ah, this is a stick handling clinic here. It looks like he's out of room about three times, and he pulls another dangle out of the bag. And then he finishes it off for good measure. What a great play. Toronto's going to try to hang on to this lead here in the late goings of this second. And it's not by back on your heels. It's by being aggressive, by forechecking, play defense in the other team's end. Oh, the thievery coming up with the puck on the play. Here's a short pass to Kemp. And they'll dump it in. Calgary's got the puck along the wall. Through the middle of the ice, they enter the attacking zone. And he makes the easy save. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Slides the puck down low. Toronto's got it from behind the net. Here's a chance. Swatted aside by the blocker. And now he tries to get it across to Muzzin. Centering pass. He scores. What a run of play this has been. Four straight goals for them. They have not taken their foot off the gas at all. You've got to get rid of that puck in a hurry from that spot on the ice. You're in the high slot, you're open, but you know everybody's converging on you. The Leafs have to be feeling good about themselves right now, Ray. A two-goal cushion as they're approaching the intermission here. They played well and they deserve to be in the lead that they're in. Now as you get close to the intermission, the coach will remind them, don't fall asleep yet. Markstrom's going to hang on for a whistle. Just here in the late stages of this frame, Toronto's really controlled the pace of play these last few minutes, leading by two. Swoops in off the wing to grab the puck after the centerman tied him up. Here's a shot, scores! Well, timing is everything. Is it ever? That's a kick in the pants to give up one that late, but that should give the other team some momentum going into the next period. Now, the only way he's stopping this one is if it hits him. As soon as the shooter went to shoot it, the goaltender dropped into the butterfly. He's looking around that traffic, hoping he can find it. 
Calgary's got a chance to change the complexion of this game now with that one. Yeah, get one now, they're within one. Don't take a step back. Push forward. Look for the equalizer. Feeds the puck to Anderson. Period number two is in the books. There's been no shortage of offense tonight. Fans tonight, the home team one is dropping $50 gift certificates to Delman's. Proud sponsor of tonight's game. With 70 stores and 14 restaurants, Delman's has it all. The third period is just moments away, and both Ray and I will be ready to bring you all the action here on EA Sports. Face-off for period number three is ready to go. It's been a throwback to 80s hockey here, and we are underway here in the third. Ray Ferraro is back down at ice level. Ray, 40 minutes played so far. What's been your assessment of this tilt? Toronto's ahead in this high-chance, high-danger game. No use changing the way you're going to play now. Oh, he'll feel that one. Musa quickly over to Kachuk. Oh, a clutch save! Away from harm's way, that's a good save. The Leafs take it along the wall. From behind the net. Oh, he got all of that with a blocker. What a stop by Markstrom. Quick feed to Lindholm. Calgary's on the attack. Hammers him into the boards. Puck carrier thought he could squeeze by. All of a sudden, the door closed. Moves it to Nylander. Gets in front of it. Goaltender covers it up. We get a whistle to slow things down. Markstrom's able to make the save on the slapper. Man, does he get that thing off and stick in a hurry. It's a good scoring chance. Lots of time left in this period. Toronto's clinging to this 4-3 lead. Picked up along the wall by Anderson. Moves the puck. Shot! Oh, what a save in front! He's sharp on this one, out on top of the crease, aggressively to make the save. Centers get set as they're ready to drop the puck again. Tavares wins the faceoff. Sends the pass over. And it's a quick pass to Nylander. Takes the feed. The Flames will play it from the defensive zone. Sends a pass over with the stop. Campbell's got it, and he'll elect for the whistle. Jumped on it pretty quickly there, and like everything else tonight, he's really looked in control. He's had an excellent game. Nearing the midway mark of the period, the Leafs lead it 4-3. Monahan's won the draw. Look out! Scores! They get a chance to change the complexion of this game. That's a big goal to even the score. When you get into this position, that puck's got to be off your stick in a hurry. You don't have much time to think about it. Calgary's counterpunched back to even things up in the third. There were times it looked like they weren't going to get back to this point, but now you've made it a sprint to the finish. Monahan's won it. From center, they get into the attacking area. Tanev's got it along the boards. And the puck's knocked loose. Quick pass to Coleman. Puts it in for the go ahead goal. Control the game now. You finally got the lead. You've worked so hard to get in front. Don't give it up now. Man, it looks like a bus depot in front of the net. You know it's a tough one when you can't see the goalie. That means he can't see the puck.
the Flames have jumped out to a one-goal lead here in this third. Well, pretty clear this game's not going to spread out at all. Two very equal teams battling it out. Taken by Muzzin. Dumps it into the Ozone. The Flames have it behind the cage. Calgary's got a hold of it along the wall. Tries to make a move and can't hang on to the puck. Monaghan's got the green light to try this move almost anywhere on the ice. The coaches have great faith in his ability. He scores! Now you gotta keep clawing back. Trailing in the game, they get the equalizer. That's a good shot. He zips it by the goaltender, but he works himself into a clean area on the ice to shoot this from the high slot. The Leafs have answered back with a huge goal here in the middle stages of this third period. It's always dangerous when you chase the game, but now that you've leveled it off, you feel good entering into the last stages of period three. And that's blocked. Moves with the puck at the corner. Just rocked on the play. Ben, you hear the old term bone jarring? That one had to hurt. The boards are still moving from that collision. Goodrow's on the receiving end of this huge hit. Sometimes you've got nowhere to go. Kachuk's known for trying just about anything to get pucks past goalies. His it's tricky zone ability means he pulls off highlight reel attempts that people can't even execute in practice, guys. It's really something to see. Slides the puck ahead into the neutral zone. He was totally locked in on that play. A little banging and crashing now. The Leafs gain control of the puck against the wall. Shot! Oh, that's blocked! What a stop by Markstrom! That's a pretty athletic save there, James. He was deked out a bit. I thought that puck was going in the net, but he stopped it. Check in with our own Carlin Bade. Who had the better night in that head-to-head -head matchup with the Stars? Kachuk's a great player when he gets engaged, and he has been that tonight with the offensive side of this game. I've been impressed with his performance. Here's a short pass to Kachuk. Campbell's gonna hang on and just let things settle down for a moment. He really didn't have many options to play the puck, but no. in a close game, you want to be sure every time you do. Here in the back half of this period, we are all tied up in this one. Well, that's one way to win the... He scores! Breaks the deadlock! Really good play at the net. And now somebody's got a lead, and we'll see if they can increase it. We get another look at this goal. What a great finish here. If you're a goal scorer, your dream line mate is somebody that can find you in traffic or when you're open and put the puck not to an area, but right on your stick. That is a slick pass. Calgary's close to the finish line, and they've got the one-goal lead. Keep pushing. You've got the lead, but don't let it slip away by trying to be too conservative. Puck scooped up by Hall. Toronto's got it along the wall. That pass doesn't go. They go on the attack through center. Toronto's gained possession along the boards. And now it's grabbed by Muzzin. Moves it quickly. And that pass goes off a stick. Receives the pass. And that's turned aside by Markstrom. Good save. Positional save through traffic. Moves it quickly over to Matthews. And uses the length of his stick to knock that puck away. And makes the save. Stuffs him again. Denies him. Gonna have to work a lot harder to beat him tonight, I guess. There's two excellent saves in a row. Great defensive effort with the stick. Shot, and that banks off a stick. Calgary's got the puck. Tries to get it over to Kachuk. Calgary's got the puck against the boards. Tosses it to Matthews. Slides the puck across to Brody. Over the line they come. Calgary's got a hold of the puck now. The Leafs take possession in the neutral zone. Quick feed to Kerfoot. Here's 
a shot. And the goaltender comes up with a piece of it to keep it out of the net. Puck picked up by Richie. Backlund's got it through the neutral zone. Oh, the sauce on that pass. Toronto's got it behind the net. Angles it over to Engvall. Picked off by Backlund. Muzzin's got it in the defensive end. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Scooped up along the wall by Kent. Through the neutral zone up along the wing. Sends it in on the attack. The Flames have it now. Oh, and a smart heads-up play. Under a minute to go here in regulation time. Now you don't have to build a new hotel every time you have the puck. Just get the thing forward. Don't turn it over. Don't make a mistake that allows them to come back and push against your team. And the coaches go with a desperation play here. Cult, and there it is. Empty netter. That'll seal it up. Pretty easy one right there for him to cash in. It's like a one-man distribution center. Get open, and it's right on your tape. The Flames add the insurance marker, which pretty much seals the deal on this one tonight, Ray. Well, their opponents pull the goalie. They're trying to pressure to get the tying goal, but it backfires, and the empty netter puts it away. And that's picked up by Goudreau. The Flames will play it against the boards. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Oh, and it just misses the corner as it goes wide. They just can't get the puck on the net. They do great work to create the chance, but the goalie does. Fires, empty net goal. That should be the night, Razor. Yeah, everybody jumps up in the seats, too. I mean, this thing is pretty well over. That should be enough to wrap this thing up. The empty net goal should seal it. Official signals for the players to get into position and we're about ready to drop the puck. Calgary's won the draw and they take possession here in the open ice. And that's all she wrote from this one here tonight. The players hate this. It gets frustrating. You give up the one empty netter, and then the coach pulls the goalie again. Everybody knows you're not coming back. It made zero sense to keep the net empty at the certain point when you gave up the first goal, and it just continued to bite them in the you-know-where. Foot? Yes. For Ray Ferraro, my name is James Sabalski. Thanks so much for joining us, everybody. Have a great night.